a recent, um, so, a, f a few years ago, or maybe, like, maybe 12 years ago, I think, maybe, um, a Greek engineer, pa Panagotis, I think, Panagotis Virtus, figured out how to make 6x6 and 7x7 cubes, so, here's the 6x6 cube, and as you can see, there's a 7x7 cube down there, um, so a 6x6 cube, so, so it's a 6x6x6, six by six by six. um, the V cube 6, so the V cube 6, which is uh, just a 6x6 six six Rubik's Cube. A V cube 7 is a 7x7x7 seven 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 Rubik's Cube. Um, so the V cube 6 has this many combinations. It has 1, 5, 7, 1, 5, 2. Still have to go. Still more. Six eight four, which is interesting. This is six nine four. This is six eight four. Huh. Um. So three more pairs of zeros. One two three. One two three. One, two, three. Okay, this is a big, 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 giant number. The next one, I don't think I'm gonna have space to write it. So this one, this giant number. <sighs> that, that is a big number, just for the six by six, this thing. Wow. Oh, I'm deleting the numbers. Wow. Wow, this is a big number. You might want to take a screenshot of it. Actually, that's what I'm going to do now. So, if you have a Mac like me, press Command, Shift. Actually, press Command, Shift, 5. And then you'll get into this mode where you can just take a screenshot of this. Like that. And then you'll hear a little capture. There we go. That, that sound. Okay, so... That is how many combinations there are for a 6x6. Six six. And I, I, I see that the, the color is getting kind of boring, so I'm going to use this color instead. Okay, so let's try, let's try to see how many combinations there are in a V-cube 7. So, I don't think I'm going to have enough space to write this. So, I'm going to get rid of the zeros, and I'm going to write it... Um, Oh yeah, by the way, this number, you can say it as, um, um, you can say sep, <laughs> sep, ten, sep, sep, ten trigantillion. So, it's 157 sep, ten trigantillion, um, this number. Just, just for a brief heads up. Okay? Everyone know that number? Okay, anyway. Okay, so, I'm gonna be writing small here. Something like that. Um, okay, so the V cube seven, aka seven by seven, um, has nineteen um, five zero zero. And finally, 11 pairs. And here's the number of how many combinations on a V cube 7, aka 7 by 7. And this is aka, um, so this number is aka um, 19 duoquin quagantillion. 19.5. 19 19.5 19 duo, 19.5 duoquin quagantillion. <laughs> that, that is a mouthful. Um, anyway. So this is more combinations than than eight independent three by three cubes, and yet a few people can solve the seven by seven in just a few minutes. That's pretty. That's pretty amazing. Um, no, um, we we do have other higher cubes than that, um, but not everyone has them, which is kind of obvious because like there are a few other ones. So 
In the, but in the meantime, while you're waiting to get one, there are some softwares that let you um, that let you play with any size cube. So these these larger sizes are not even even the teensiest harder than the seven by seven. They're just more te tedious. The eight by eight. So I have a photo of an eight by eight here, which is pretty big. I'm gonna have to zoom out a little. And there's the nine by nine. So. Gonna do the combinations for a nine by nine next. Okay. Anyway, so the combinations for an eight by eight. I'll just separate this out. Okay. So the combinations for eight by eight. The eight by eight would. Um, so I don't want to write this thing out, but I have to. So the eight by eight cube has, and I'll just lower the pen width. That's better. Uh, so we have um, thirty five. Maybe that's a bit too big. 35, mm, 1, 7, 3.